This is uh, Alan Bragg, and Alan drives the 89 uh, Bomber, and he also drives in the Trophy Dash class at the Soto Speedway. Alan, what is it? Uh, what are some of the things that you like about the Soto Speedway? Well, uh, I've raced at about four different tracks in the state of Florida, and the best thing about the Soto is the high banking that we have here. It's definitely the fastest track around. Uh, I used to run a pure stock, which uh, we're on the 8-inch Hoosiers, and uh, that's getting the throw it in the corner and feel the grip and everything. is uh, It's a whole lot of fun. Okay, so you, you like it because it's really a fast track? Yes, sir. All right, yeah. great. Thanks a lot, Alan. We appreciate you talking to us. Thank you, Tony. This is the 2008 Pure Stock Champion Driver. Uh, this is Randy Johnson, and Randy's been racing here for a lot of years. Randy, what is it about DeSoto Speedway that you like? Uh, DeSoto is just, it's a nice fast track. they got plenty of banking. I've been to a couple other tracks, and they're not quite banked enough. It's closer to my house also. Uh, it's just an overall good place, you know, the people that work here, the staff, they usually seem to help you pretty much if you got a problem to work with you. If you got a car down or something like that, they'll move some classes around. I've had really good luck with that. Uh, all around good group of people out here. I've just had, you know, a whole lot of fun coming out here. I've been coming out here since about 2004 when my nephew started racing mini stocks. And I got into it a couple of years later and been hooked ever since. Great. Well, thanks a lot for talking to us, Randy. Thank you. This is uh, Ronnie Robinson, and he uh, drives in the uh, Flying Four class. And uh, Ronnie, uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about how long you've been driving and why you like the Soto Speedway? Well, I've been driving since May. I just put my first car together, came out here to learn how to drive and have fun. And the, what I like about the track is I just like the speed, I like the high banks, the way they feel. I like all the people out here. There's a lot of good people out here. And it's just overall, it's just fun to come out and race. Well, great. Thanks a lot for talking to us, Ronnie. All right, thank you very much. Here we have Michael Crooks. He's also known as the Punisher, and he's a bomber driver here at DeSoto. Mike, why why is it that you race at DeSoto? What is it you like about the track? Well, I came here after the closing of Sunshine Speedway and fell in love with this track because of the high banks. It can get you go a lot faster and uh, a lot of respect around this track. Everybody drives really well. Uh, they try to get along and we all help each other out. And uh, a lot of give and take and it's just, it's really become the second home. It's, it's fun to race out here. Well, great. Thanks a lot, Mike. We Thank appreciate you. it. <laughs> and here we have Mr. John Stewart. He's also known as the mayor, the mayor of the bomber driver. And uh, John, why is it that you uh, race at DeSoto? What is it about the track that you like? I like the competitiveness, the drivers, the high bands, the speed. Uh, just a really nice uh, facility to run at. Nice facility. It's, uh, great track, good handling, bulky grooves to pass in. Uh, you know, it's just a fun track to play at. Awesome. Thanks, John. And here we have Jerome Watlin, known as Romy, the Romanator, uh, the dominator of the bombers in DeSoto Super Speedway. Romy, you've been coming here for some time. What is it uh, that you like about DeSoto Speedway? Well, the thing about it is the banks here, they're not big like deep, but it's, it's the deepest bank in the state of Florida. It's a fast track. It's a four and five wide track. I've okay. been five wide here before. It's a lot of fun. It's it can bite you at the same time. Uh, it's very enjoyable. Okay. Uh, the guys you race with is a lot of fun because there's so much competitiveness between us all. But yet we go out to breakfast in the morning after after we get done racing. There's no I mean. Everybody comes for the brawls and the mayhem and stuff, yes, but we don't do that. Why? I don't know. I mean, we well, do I think you bomber drivers are almost like a fraternity. Everybody helps everybody. A couple of weeks ago, your car broke, and I think you had a bunch of your buddies here helping yeah, you get it back I mean, together. We destroyed a car coming out of the wall, coming out and uh, hitting turn two wall there, and. Uh, we put together another car, a whole car, complete car, in less than a week. And that's saying something. You know, yep. to get back out here just to race with your buddies. Yep. Um, the track, I'm, it's, I mean, 
the drainage around here, even when it rains, I mean, you get, it, usually you get uh, tracks that get rained on and you rained out. This thing here can be poured on two inches deep. An hour later, the drainage here just is, is, is just, it, it's dry. It's dry. It, it's unbelievable. I mean, it rains, you, an hour later you could be racing. I mean, you're going to have some wet spots here and there, but essentially you can race on the track even though it does rain. Awesome. Um, okay. Well, thanks a lot for uh, talking to me and good luck tonight. Thank you. Okay, and here we have Art Danielson and Art races in the Flying Fours here at the Soto Speedway. Hey, Art, what is it that uh, what is it that you like about racing at the Soto? Oh, this place is fast. It's uh, it's easy to get to from almost anywhere. I ran here since the early '90s. I ran my street stocks and sports down here. Uh, it's a great facility. I mean, uh, nice place in the state that I've that I've ever been to. The uh, racetrack is fast, um, people are pretty nice here, it's, it's family oriented, just like this place. Yeah. Want to see it here, tell me buy this place, we want to have, we love this place. Alright, awesome, thanks. Yeah, no problem. This is uh, Jessica Ostrowska's and Jessica, you've been racing here for a couple years and uh, what is it that... How'd you get started here at DeSoto, and what do you like about the track? Um, many places will actually let a 15-year-old drive, and I started here when I was 15 years old, and I am now 19. Still loving this place. This place is my every weekend hangout. Um, love this track. It's high banked, really fast, really, really fun to run on. Um, very family oriented, and I've actually met a lot of great friends out here, and that's what keeps me coming back. Awesome. Well, thanks a lot for talking to me, and good luck tonight. Thank you. And here we have Jimmy Best, and Jimmy, uh, gosh, he races so many different classes out here at the DeSoto Super Speedway, and he and his brother have been champions out here for a number of years. Jimmy, what is it that keeps bringing you back to DeSoto, and what is it that you like about DeSoto Super Speedway? Oh, what I like about DeSoto Super Speedway, it's got multi-grooves track. You can, you can pass on the outside, pass on the inside. I mean, you really can work the track. It's wide. It's got nice banking. The facility is in real, you know, decent shape. It's, you know, got a lot of pit parking, and it's just a really good place to race. I mean, when you really want it, you can have some good action here, side by side, and you don't have to feed on the bottom. You can get to the, if you, if you know, if you don't, if you need to go to the outside, it's got an outside groove, and that's what really makes this place. I mean, it's compared to a lot of the tracks in the state of Florida. This is, I would rank this the top three tracks to be at in the state of Florida. So it's, you know, it is the place you want to race at. If you're going to race anywhere, you want to race at DeSoto Speedway. Oh, great. Okay, thanks a lot. No problem. Appreciate it. And here we have Tom, and uh, Tom drives uh, the Outlaw Modified, and it's a traveling series here in the state of Florida. Tom, uh, you've been racing here at DeSoto quite a bit. What is it uh, that you like about the track? Well, first of all, we go to a number of tracks, as you said. Uh, a lot of them are shorter tracks, a lot of them are flatter, and what we like about DeSoto is you can let it all hang out. Um, you know, I, I hardly even lift at all going through the turns. In fact, there are some nights where the car hooks up really good and I can just you know, keep my foot in the gas all the way around the turn. And We had, uh, about the last time we were here, we had one of the younger drivers ask me, he says, well, what makes you so fast? You know, I can't keep up with you. And my first question I asked him, I said, well, are you stepping on the brake going in a turn? He said, yeah. I said, that's your problem. Okay, <laughs> you just got to go for it. So definitely, yeah, we love the track uh, itself. But we also like the, the staff and the fans here. They, they always welcome us. They always cheer for us. And standing in the winter circle and doing an interview there, you know, it's, it's really kind of special. Great. Well, thanks a lot, Tom, and uh, good luck tonight. All right, thank you. And here we have Rick Mills. Rick is also an outlaw modified driver. And uh, Rick, what is it about the Soto Speedway that makes you come back, and what do you like about driving here? Well, it's close to home for one thing. Uh, a lot of history at this track. have been here for, for a long time. I remember when I was a young kid coming up here and watch people and everybody. Where are you from, Rick? I live in Arcadia now, but I did live in Fort Myers most of my life. So, okay. you know, we come up to watch. Uh, it's a nice track, it's nice and wide, people are running it real nice, the fans are friendly. Great. Uh, pit area is nice, you know, it's concrete everywhere. So it's so, a good facility for oh, you? absolutely, real nice clean facility, uh, everybody's Great. real friendly. They do tire mounting, fuel cells, everything here. Great. A lot of times there's a parts guy here selling parts. Awesome. So,